it the way that you want. Um, yeah, games do have rules, but rules are made to, in many cases, in many cases, to be broken. So, yeah, select it to pick it up. Cut the blue wire. Is this the blue? Let's try this wire. Nope, nope. You can't tell me what to do. I'm gonna click here. Oh, fine, fine. I'll cut the blue wire. Yeah, got it. All right, pick this one up. It's the second module. Press the button. Uh, okay. Yeah, no, I know I can inspect any of the sides, top or bottom and all that. Um, oh, okay, this is how I spin it around. That's pretty cool. Deselect it to put it back on the table and to finish the tutorial. Uh, what if I want to pick up the other one? What about when I want to pick this one up again? And spin it around? I wonder, can I pick... Okay. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. It remembers the orientation that you're dropping it in. Did not know that. That's pretty cool. Alright. It's a fun little tutorial. Oh, you can always see a diagram. Um, but can you do the tutorial again? I'm curious. Oh yeah. Wow, I've cleared game over you and rolls and the tutorial. Alright. Here we go. Yeah, I, I know, I know. I got this. Pretty sure I got this. Alright. I'm gonna start. Alright, the blue abort button. We're gonna release it. I don't know. How about now? Alright. Um, do we have any stuff over here? Yeah, I don't know. Um, got some crazy symbols over here. Ah, oh, I missed it. Shoot. Well, better luck next time, right? All right, we're gonna get this. This is how you play the game. All right, let's try. Right, okay, well that was wrong too. You know, what are the odds? If I keep missing the correct button, you, you'd expect that like, um, I would press the correct button like, first out of one of those tries. It's like a one in four chance of getting it wrong. There we go. Now we're talking. And let's see, which one do I cut? How about this one? Awesome! Thus proving that this is doable. It's just not the way that you want to do it. time. Well, that's cool. <laughs> I imagine they will get more difficult after that one. Um, Alright, this will be half comforting. Let's give it a go. Hmm. Does this one have a button? This one lacks a button. This one looks a little trickier than the last one. Okay. Eh, it's just ticking away. You know. Ah! So close. Maybe next time. Alright. But no, I'm just curious. How quickly... It, what does it take to pick up this game? Um... Let's see, can I cut the blue wire? Alright, um, it's not the blue wire. Okay, cut the yellow wire. Hmm. Alright, so I'm gonna learn the memory game too. 
I'm just curious how long it takes to learn the manual um, by playing it this way. This is like Simon says squared, cubed, quadrupled, and all that. Oh, one thing I do need to look out for is like various markings and such that are on the bomb. Um, all right. So, okay, well, I'm probably not going to pass the maze, but I'm just curious. So, like, here we got some batteries, we got some, like, parallel port. No, that's a DVI port. Um, that's another DVI port. Uh, that's cool. All right. Um, so, there's a lot of yellow wire. I'm gonna try cutting the middle one of those. Nope. How about the bottom one? How about the top one? Alright. I think I know which wire to cut. Um, this is definitely a unique way to play the game. Uh, I'm giving myself a lot of credit and having fun doing this, but... I don't know that anybody else has tried this before. Okay, is this one of these things just supposed to tap it? No. Okay, um, oh, let's try to learn memory. Press the four? No, four is not four. Okay, how about four is three? No. Okay, we're gonna get this. This is gonna be fun, once I finally do master it. I swear, chess openings are way harder than this. Alright, so four is not four, nor is it three. How about two? Four is two. Four is not two. Okay. Are you reading the manual yourself? What manual? Oh. This game has a manual? Okay. Now you tell me. Well, that's pretty false. <laughs> no, this is the way to play it, man. Go big or go home. You almost made it. I know, right? Would you believe I've defused one bomb? Really? Yes. <laughs> Beginner level bomb? Yeah. Alright, I'll pull up the manual. Oh, come on! But I won't look at the screen, so... My point is I don't want to have directions, I just want to, like, play it and see what happens. Uh, it's more fun that way. Because <laughs> right. I bet very few people have tried that. And it just seems like an outrageously fun thing to do. So one is two. After that, three. Let's try the same number. Nope. Okay, one is two. Not two. Alright. Maybe one is the second position rather than it being two. We'll see. We're gonna work our way to the top here. The only thing that's regrettable is the number, uh, well, the delay between the tries. Alright, there's a lot of wires here. Let's cut the one in the middle. Let's put the yellow one. Whoops, I missed the button. Well, we're gonna learn something here. Yeah, we learned something. We learned that you can't do that exactly the way you do it. This is science here, guys. <laughs> Who needs the manual? There's the, uh... Oh, the manual. Alright, so... All manuals Okay, it's not one of those that you just press. Um, okay. That's right. oh, that was close. We got one module there. That being the button. Um, I mean, I have seen some playthroughs of this game, so I kind of sort of know what I'm doing. Which is kind of crazy. In many respects, I still don't know, but um, by process of elimination. So, Dude, I am playing this game. What are you talking uh, about? Fair enough. I, would, I need to try it this way. I mean, it just seems like the most outrageous thing to do, and I'm surprised nobody, I've never heard anybody else try this. Um... Okay, by process of elimination, and then move to other modules. 
I just want to see if this is doable. <laughs> like, beating the game... I mean, yeah, I've seen people play it, so it's not like I'm doing this completely from scratch. But there's no way I remember it all, so... Um, so I'm just focusing on the little memory module here. Okay. Got a two. <laughs> Alright. We got a three. <laughs> Um, this sucks. This manual is terrible. Yeah, the manual's it's total utter crock. Uh, so three is four. One, we're gonna guess four again. Okay. Two. Ah. Oh. All right. Working my way up the memory tree. There's only like twenty things you have to remember there, in terms of instructions, and then. Um, you have to also remember what you're doing as you're going along, which is a little bit trickier. Um, so I'm gonna guess... Nope, that's not right. I'm gonna guess... Nope, that's still not right. Okay. I'm surprised the game doesn't, like, eject you for trying what I'm trying. I guess they just never suspected that you go for it. Ooh, we got Simon Says. Wait, I need to, like, look at the bomb first. Um, okay. And sure. Yeah, that's fancy. Just look at it, spin it around, have some fun with that. Um, okay. So, yeah, there's two things, if I remember right, that matter in the Simon Says game. Okay. Ah! Okay, and then the pattern changes. Okay. Um, nope. Okay, well this just got a little bit trickier. Okay. I think it's important to get the Simon module down and do it first. Just if I remember enough about how the manual works. And how if you get some strikes it changes its rules and such. And... Wait, okay. It's red. Okay, looking at this. Alright, so we got the same rule set as last time. Uh, if I remember right, so last time we went... Um, blue red and I did red green and that was cool so this time being starting with red I hit green which is wrong which probably means that green is correct now or now all right try two green is cool um, all right we're, we're getting there okay red yellow yellow red green blue blue green Red, yellow, yellow, red, something else. Oh! Oh yeah, I got the Simon module. Alright, now the rest of the bomb. Uh, Alright, so I remember... Uh, I kind of blew my chance earlier. Um, now, so I'm just looking around, just examining the bomb thoroughly, just for the heck of it. And also waiting for the timer to count down to a very specific number, just for the laugh. Um, man, that ticks quickly, you know? Tick, tock, tick, tock. It's nice dramatic music, by the way. Whoever did the soundtrack really did a good job doing it. But yeah, there, there is one little trick that, like, um, some clever geniuses found when they were doing this and I was watching, so I'm gonna kind of exploit that here, and exploit it to the fullest. I know, right? It's more fun playing without it. Alright, so that's two modules of three, now I just need to get four perfect button presses in a row. Uh, the odds on this are 1 in 24 if you've never seen it before, 
Um, for me, it's probably less than that. So, okay. Now I got one and six. Ooh. Oh, that's not that hard. Uh, so close. So close. Well, that was good. Um, cause of explosion. Error between keyboard and chair. Uh, yeah, but no, I, I think this is entirely doable. Uh, and I just want to see like somebody take this to the next level and actually automate it. That would be insane. Okay, so then after that... Three. Okay, so three is not push the three. Four... Four is not that. Four is... Okay. I think four is three. Two is press the same position. One is... Let's say three. Nope. But yeah, there's only a, a finite set of the number of possible rules. And... You know, I think if I could do this, how much greater it would be to write a bot that could actually play this game? It wouldn't be that hard. It would not be that hard. It would be hilarious to watch. Just scar. Yeah, people would accuse you of... Um, I don't know. Programming the manual into it. Oh. Yeah, that's what you do. <laughs> no, I mean, no. You do it like the whole neural network thing. You, you don't, like, cheat. I mean, okay, sure, it ends at the same result, but the discovery is the fun part. Ah, we're getting there, we're getting there. I just want to see if I could get one more. Uh, it says press. Uh, I think I'm just going to hold it instead of pressing it. Yeah, the button's all depressed. Alright, so... If I remember right... Um, rule here... No. No, I don't remember. Okay. But I am slowly getting the hang of this. And I think a bot would even more quickly get the hang of what's going on. Okay, so, um, I think this is one of those you just tap it. All right. Three, I think, is four. No, three is not four. All right, three is one. Three is not one. Okay, one is two. One is not two. blue now. Alright. See? Easy peasy. Green, green, blue. Blue, blue, green. Alright. Green, green, blue, red. Blue, blue, I think green, red? Nope. That was yellow. It's good to know, though. Uh, blue, blue, okay. Green, green, blue, red is gonna become... Yellow, yellow, red, green. Okay, cool, we got one. Um, Alright, well, let's try this. Okay. Alright, and then the button. Everybody's favorite button. Um, if I remember right, yeah. I remember right. This is one of those that I just wait for the timer to go down to the magic number. And then hold and release the button. And I'm pretty sure I got this. I could mess this up, 
definitely could happen. But how great would it be if I could get this? Tick tock, tick. On the fair, in fairness, I'm not going to set any record by doing it this way, other than just a record of having the most fun playing the game in a most original fashion. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to wait. Just going to wait for it to tick and talk. Yeah, it's got a little speaker with little dots there and such. It's pretty cool. Alright, so here we go. Six, five, four. There we go. We got it. <laughs> That's two bombs down. All right, it's time to get some dinner, and then we'll be back. Sorry for cutting things so quick. Um, but, yeah, we'll be around. Uh, I need to have dinner first, so. Um, I'll see you next time. Studying this menu.